I'm Douglas Besson, 58 years old, from Freeland, New Jersey, Monmouth County, New Jersey, United States. Perfect. So can you tell us a little bit how affordable housing has impacted your life? It gave me a place to live. Uh, I belong to agencies that's really good, Easter Seals. They take me to my doctor's appointments. They help me, they monitor my medication, make sure I take the proper dosage. We take the grocery shopping. Wow. We have recreation activities. They help me cook. And they, uh, they keep me functioning on a high level of ability. So what would happen if you didn't have this access to affordable housing? This agency wasn't able to help you? I'd probably be an institution. So what would you tell your members of Congress? What's important? How should they protect affordable housing for people? Well, I would say for Easter Seals, I would hope they would add fun to Easter Seals so that more people get good quality because Easter Seals is different. We have houses, okay. not boarding homes. And it's a lot different. We have we have staff that there's their 12-hour staff. And... Uh, when we're not there at night, we're, we're able to function on a good level, and it's really good. And we have, we have like, Oak Tree Lodge, barbecues, Blue wow. Claws games, Lakewood Township, Ocean County. We go on field trips. We go to parks. We have barbecues. Hey, can I ask you one thing? I heard that you're a veteran. Do you yeah. feel that homelessness impacts veterans in a... Certain way that it doesn't affect, right? yeah, it so does, it does, it does because, like, I, I was in the Marine Corps, but I, I, I got sick, and uh, my father, I was in a Christian house. My father came to Texas and he said, I'll put you in Easter Seals. I've been in there Easter Seals for 22 years, okay, wow. so without them, you would be homeless. I'd, I'd probably be in a state hospital, and if, and that has some, I wouldn't, I wouldn't, want, I wouldn't want to be there. No, but thank you so much for sharing your story. And it's so important that we actually do advocate for veterans, especially in the state of New Jersey, that they do get homes. A lot of them do face homelessness. Yes. So thank you for sharing your story. So You're welcome. Important. Thank you.